everybody. I'm Holly with Pilates and Yoga Center. Um, we're getting ready to start bar and stretch. So at six o'clock we'll be starting the bar section. All you need is a chair or a sturdy countertop or if you don't have any of that, just work that balance. Um, at 6.30 we'll transition down to the mat and we'll be doing some Pilates mat exercises and yoga based stretches. So that being said, I'm gonna go ahead and flip you guys around and we'll be getting started shortly. So I will be using the Pilates ball today. So it's a small little gray ball. Um, yours might be a different color. If you do not have one, that's okay as well. Um, we'll also be using some light hand weights. So let me just double check myself. And we will be getting started in just a few minutes. Now, if you're watching with me tonight, if you have any requests, and you can type them in within the next two minutes when I see them. Type them in, let me know what type of exercise you want. Catherine, I see you're watching. Happy birthday. Today's Catherine's birthday, so if any of you guys know Catherine, let her know happy birthday. Happy, happy birthday. It's good my sound is on. Saying hi is important too. It makes me feel loved. Yay. All right. So. Give me a few more short seconds and I will get us started. And as always, if for some reason this video would cut out while I'm making it, say my internet goes kooky on me, just refresh your browser. I'll probably be back on loading on, unless it was like a few weeks ago when my phone just crashed. Um, I had to turn my phone off, turn it back on. Long story short, I don't think I ever logged back on because it had been too long of a break, and I'm like, they're probably not holding in for me. So. That being said, who's ready to get this starts this class started? I am. Because it's Tuesday night. Tuesday night is my favorite. I don't know why. I like bar. Oh, I have another question for you all. If you like bar, would you want a bar class on a Tuesday night? Let me know. So let's get to it. Let's go ahead and stand up. We're just going to start with a warm up. So go ahead and bring those heels right underneath your shoulders, arms down by your side. And we're just going to take it with a stretch here, taking the head to the right and the left, right and left, right and left, right and left and right and left. Now make that head say no, right and left. And right. Already starting to engage those legs. Make sure you're pulling that belly in. Good. Now we're taking the hips to the right and the left. And right. And left. And right. And you're kind of stretching down the side of that leg as we take those hips. Now speed it up. Right, left. Right, left. Good. Quicker. Right, left. Right, left, right, left, right, left. Good, from here, turning those knees out, bringing those arms slightly out to the side. We're gonna get ready to swim some of the ice heaver to warm up those legs. So we bend up, bend up, 
bend, up, good. Four more, bend, bend, knees are going right over the toes. Bend, hold it here, lift that right foot. Two, three, four, five, six, seven, squeeze the glutes. Now the left, two, three, strong arms, four, five, reaching those fingertips long, seven, eight, take it to fours, right foot, two, three, four, and the left foot, two, three, four, taking it to singles, right, left, right, left, right, you should feel those quads warming up, left, pause it here, Rib cage right, left, keeping that bend of the leg. Left, right, left, right, left. Speed it up and right, left, right, left. Good, keep it going. Just trying to work the rib cage right, left, right, left, right, left, right, left. Good, right here. Pulse. Two, three, four, five, six, seven. Eight and eight, seven, six, five, four, three, two, one more set for eight, seven, six, five, four, three, two, one. Beautiful. Bringing those arms all the way up, taking that left hand, reaching it out to the side, stretching it over, holding it here, really stretching through the side of the body. Good. From here, flipping the body, turning to the diagonal. Stretching it forward, keeping both heels on the ground. From here, stretching it all the way down to that foot. Holding it here. From here, bring that arm back out. Bring it all the way up, reaching out to the left. Now reach to that right side, stretching it over. Holding it here, finding that length through the side. Good, holding it. Bringing it all the way up. From here, turning to the diagonal. Stretching it forward. Long spine here, crown of the head is reaching forward. Holding it there. Reaching all the way down to that foot. Enjoying that stretch, bringing that arm all the way up. Flip it back over, bringing it up. We're gonna take our around the world. So reach it to the left, down, right and up. Other way, right, ground, left and up. Repeat that, right. Sorry, left, center, up, and again, side, down, center, bring it up, beautiful. Go ahead, walk those feet in. We're gonna turn those legs parallel. Arms are gonna reach all the way up. From here, we're gonna take a flat back, reaching those fingertips forward. From here, we pulse for eight, seven, six, five, four, three, two, one, and eight, seven, six, five, four, three, two, one. One more set, eight, seven, six, five, four, three, two, one. Good, drop it down towards those feet, walk them out a little bit, stretching out those hamstrings. Good, from there, go ahead, take the forehead as close as you can to your knees, bring those arms down by the side of your legs, taking an inhale as you exhale, reaching the arms all the way back up. From here, we're gonna open those legs, right underneath your shoulders. From here, sitting it down into a chair pose like yoga, reaching those arms up. You should be able to look down and see those toes. From here, we're gonna pulse it. Here we go, four, eight, seven. Squeezing the glutes, trying to keep the belly pulled into the spine. Eight, seven, six, five, four, three, two, one. Eight more, eight, seven, six, five, four, three, Taking it into our John Travolta leg. Front, side, back, side, and front, side, back, side. Keep it going, front, side. The supporting leg's bent. You should feel that quad. And front, side, back, side. Switch the leg. So left leg, side, both hip up. Staying forward, side, front, side, back, side. Keep it going, front, side, 
back, side, last set, front, side, back, side. Good, stretch those arms all the way up. And back out to the side. Beautiful, we're gonna take it to your chair. Get ready to get started for some plies. So those heels are together, kneecaps are turned slightly out. We're gonna take our arm out to the side, getting ready to plie. Here we go, we bend, we stretch, bend, and stretch, bend, and stretch. When you stretch, we're squeezing those inner thighs. Bend, and stretch, bend, stretch. Keep it going like that. Stretch, trying to keep the heels on the ground. Knees going right over those toes. Squeezing the glutes. Now we're gonna add a releve. So we're going to plie, releve. Straighten the legs, drop those heels. Again, plie, pulling the belly in, having some tension in that arm out to the side. And plie, releve, lift. Drop the heels one more in this direction, plie. Releve, up, squeeze the glutes. Now reverse it, up, bend. Drop those heels, squeeze those inner thighs, up, bend. Drop the heels, squeeze the inner thighs. Keep it going, bend. Drop the heels, squeeze the thighs, and up, bend. Drop the heels, squeeze the thigh. From here, we releve up and down. Now I want you to imagine you have a quarter and you're trying to squeeze it between your butt cheeks. Yes, that's a goofy analogy, but I bet you it'll make you squeeze your butt. That's what we want to do. And lower, lift, and lower, lift, and lower, making sure that lower back isn't overly arching and you're keeping this rib cage closed. And lower, up, and lower, up, and lower. One more up. Hold it here. Arm comes up. From here, we're taking it into a plie. Those knees are coming right over the toes, and we're getting ready for some pulses. Here we go. So pulse. Two, three, four, five. Keep trying to keep those knees turned out. And eight, seven, six, five, four, three, two, one. And eight, seven, six, five, four, three, two, one. One, eight more, eight, seven, six, five, four, three, two, one. Drop those heels, arm comes out to the side. From here, we're gonna stretch it forward, just stretching through the back of those legs. Bringing that arm all the way up. And we're gonna stretch it back. Good, go ahead, switch your chair to the other side. Or turn around, whatever works for you. Or if you're balancing. You know what to do. So heels are coming right underneath your shoulders. Really quick, go ahead, rise up on your tippy toes. Make sure you can go all the way up, not roll out on those pinkies. If your legs are out too far, you'll notice it's kind of hard to rise up on those tippy toes. Arms gonna come out to the side, getting ready for those plies. So we're bending and up. Same thing, trying to keep the heels on the ground. We're just doing a demi plie here, keeping the belly pulled into the spine. Bend and up. Pressing the heels into the ground. Nice soft shoulder. No tension in that neck. Bend and up. Bend and up. Bend up. Squeezing that quarter in your butt cheeks. And bend and up. And bend and up. And bend and up. And bend. Let's add that releve, here we go. So we plie, we releve, we straighten the legs, we drop the heels, really working those feet. Bend, releve, up, drop the heels. Plie, releve, scoop the belly right here. Drop the heels, plie. You really gotta squeeze those muscles in your legs to get the most out of this. I slowed it down tonight so we work on that technique. Up, and bend. Drop the heels, press the heels into the ground. Up, bend, drop the heels, and up, up, bend, heels, 
straighten those legs. One more. Up. Bend. Heels. And up. Right here. Just releves. Up. And down. Up. Squeezing the glutes down. Think of those kneecaps trying to go backwards. So we're working our external rotators here. And down. Squeezing the glutes. Up. And down. Up. And down. Maybe try that balance here. Up and down. That's the nice thing about going slow. You can work on that control. And lower. Up and lower. Let's do two more here. Up and lower. Last one. Up. Hold it there. Go ahead. Take it down into your plie. And we're going to get ready to pulse it here. Here we go. Four, eight, seven, six, five, four, three, two. One, and eight, seven, six, five, four, three, two, one more set, four, eight, seven, six, five, four, three, two, one, drop those heels, take that left toe, cross it over, that arm comes up, stretching it up and over to the side, good, bringing it all the way back up, we're going to switch, take that right toe, cross it over, arm's going to come up, stretching it over to the side. Beautiful. All right. Go ahead. Face your chair. I'm going to bring mine to the other side. I'm going to take my ball and I'm going to take it and put it between my right thigh and my right calf. My left leg is going to be my supporting leg to start. So I'm going to slightly bend that leg. Now, from here, I'm leaning over slightly so I have a long spine. The crown of my head is reaching forward. From here, I'm going to lift that leg up and lower it down. Now, if you don't have a ball, you can do, still do the same movement. You're just going to lift and lower. Ready? Here we go. So we lift, we lower. We lift, we lower. Make sure both the hips are facing that chair. Lift and lower. 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 Good. Keep it going. And lower. Lift. Lower. Lift. Lower. Lift. Now we're going to add a pulse in here. So we lift. We lower. We squeeze the heel into the butt. We release it. Try it again. Up. Down. Squeeze. Release. Up. Down. Squeeze, release, up, down, squeeze, release, up, down, squeeze, let's take that to tempo. So up, down, squeeze, release, up, down, squeeze, release, up, down, squeeze, release, up, down, oops, I lost my ball, up, down, squeeze, release. Up, down, squeeze, release. I squeezed it too hard. Squeeze, release. Up, down, squeeze, release. Up, down, squeeze, release. Up, down, squeeze, release. Up, down, squeeze, release. Good. Go ahead. Grab that ball out. Now we're going to take that right leg. We're going to stretch it out to the side. So that kneecap is facing forward. The right arm is going to reach down to a low diagonal. And again, we're going to bend that left leg slightly. From here, we're lifting this leg up to the side to meet the ball. So watch. It goes like this. So we lift. We lower. Hips are facing forward. Belly's pulled in. Lift and lower. 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 Good. Now reach the ball up towards the ceiling. This time what we're going to do is we're going to bend that elbow down. As we do that, we're going to bring the knee up to the elbow. Stretch. Good. So now that kneecap's going up. Stretch. Using the oblique here to pull it down. So exhale and inhale. Exhale and inhale. Exhale and inhale. Exhale and inhale. 
exhale, really focus on using those obliques. Bend, crunch it there. Bend, and lengthen through the side body. Bend, and lengthen. Bend, and lengthen. Bend, and lengthen. We have two more. Bend, and lengthen. Last one. Bend, and lengthen. Beautiful. Give those hips a little shake. I know my supporting leg is where I really feel that. But we're going to switch to the other side, so this should be fun. So we're going to go ahead and take that ball. You know what to do. You're going to take it. You're going to put it between your calf and your thighs. So take now that right leg, slightly bend it. And we're going to focus on lifting that leg up and down. Lift and lower. Lift and lower. Lift and lower. Lift and lower. Good. Hips facing forward. Long spine. Belly scooped in. Lift and lower. Lift and lower. Lift and lower. Lift and lower. Who's ready to add that pulse? Here we go. So we lift, we lower, we squeeze. We release, we lift, we lower, we squeeze, we release, lift, and lower, squeeze, release, lift, and lower, squeeze, release, lift, lower, squeeze, release, lift, lower, squeeze, Ready to take that to the tempo. We lift, lower, squeeze, release. Lift, lower, squeeze, release. Lift, lower, squeeze, release. Lift, lower, squeeze, release. Four more. Up and squeeze. Up, lower, squeeze. Up, lower, squeeze. Last one. Up, lower, squeeze. Good. Go ahead. Grab that ball. And we're gonna take the leg out to the side. That kneecap comes forward, slightly bend that supporting leg. Arms gonna reach out to a diagonal here. Remember, kneecaps are facing forward for this one. Up and down, squeezing the glute as you lift. Lower, lift and lower, hips face forward. Lift and lower, lift and lower, lift and lower, lift and lower, lift, and lower, lift, and lower. Who feels that booty burning? And lower, lift, and lower, and lift, and lower. Good, now take that ball up towards the feeling. Feel this length through the side of your body. This time the kneecap's gonna turn up, and we bend, and stretch. So we're using those obliques to pull the elbow to the knee and bend, and stretch, bend, inhale, exhale, inhale, exhale, inhale, exhale. Using those abs, that supporting leg is still slightly bent. You should feel that glute working, and bend, and stretch, bend, and stretch, bend, and stretch. Bend and stretch. Let's do two more. Bend and stretch and bend and stretch. Beautiful. Go ahead, drop that ball down. From here, we're going to face the chair. Just go ahead, take those hips backwards for a stretch here. Long spine. From here, just walk out the feet a little bit. Lift the right foot and the left. Right and left. Right and left. Right and left, right, and left, right, and left, and right, and left. Good. Go ahead. Touch down to those toes. Roll that spine all the way up, lifting those shoulders up and down. We're going to go ahead and grab your light hand weights now. You can take your chair, slide it out of the way if you would like. I'm going to slide mine out of the way. And we're going to go ahead 
and begin in the second position here. So you want those heels right underneath your shoulders. Arms are gonna come out to the side, the palm of your hands are facing inwards. From here, we're gonna take a plie as we hug a tree. Yeah, so heels are pressed down into the ground. Inhale, reach them up, growing, lengthening that spine, but not popping the rib cage. Exhale, close the arms. Inhale, lengthen, close, and open, 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 close, hold them here now, here we pulse, four, eight, seven, six, five, four, three, two, take the arms up, two, three, four, five, six, seven, take the arms side, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, and close, two, three, four, five, six, seven, repeat that up, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, and side, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, and together, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, good, take them out to the side, go ahead, bring those feet together into your Pilates stance from here, flipping the palms down, we're going to go circles, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, and eight, seven, six, five, four, three, two, one, take the circles back, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, and eight, seven, six, five, four, three, two, one, right palm up, left palm up, and right, and left, so we're alternating, flipping those palms, and left, and right, and left, from here, speed it right, left, 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 right, left. Freeze them, both palms down. From here, we're gonna get ready to do tiny little arm circles, taking those arms up to a high V. So you should feel those arms starting to fire. Here we go. And two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. Circle them backwards, bringing them back down to that T. Five, six, seven, eight. Circle them forward, taking them up. Three, four, five, six, seven, eight. Circle them back. Two, three, four, five, six, seven, up. Four, one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. Take them back. Two, three, four, five, six. We have one more set. Take them up. Two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. Take them back. Two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. Beautiful, send those arms down. Let's bring that left arm up over your head, stretching over to the side. Bringing that arm all the way back up, switching it out, the right arm will come up. Take it over the head, stretching it out. Good, sending that arm down. From here, we're gonna take the arms out to the side, making your muscle arms here. Now, right now for me, squeeze your glutes, squeeze those inner thighs, pull the belly in. We squeeze, we lift. We squeeze. Keeping those elbows up in line with your shoulders, and lift, and squeeze, and lift. Keep it going, squeeze, and lift, and squeeze, and lift, squeeze and lift, and squeeze, and lift. Now watch me, we releve as we pulse, and lower, and up. So we're trying to, um, the arms go up a little bit like this, and lower. So almost like we wanna straighten them, but we're not. And pulse, and lower, and pulse, and lower, and pulse, and lower. Keep it going, pulse, and lower. Pulse, and lower, pulse, and lower, pulse, and lower. Right here, quick pulses. Up, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, and eight, seven, six, five, four, 
three, two, one. Now watch, arm in, arm in, arm out, arm out. Keep it going, in, in, open, open. Speed that up, so in, in, open, open, in, in. Good, really trying to squeeze those biceps. Keep it to the beat, in, 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 in. In, 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 in. Good, in, open, in, open, in, open, in, open. We got four more. Three, two, one. Hold them here, we're pulsing up. Two, three, four, five, six. Come on, you guys, we got this. And eight, seven, six, five, four, three, two. Last set, four, eight. Seven, six, five, four, three, two. Send those arms all the way up. From here, float it forward, let them relax. Let that upper body relax a little bit. Roll it all the way up, lifting the shoulders up by the ears and rolling them back and down. Good job. All right, before we take it to the mat for our Pilates mat, I'm gonna go ahead and do some push-ups here. So if you're getting ready to join us for a Pilates mat, we'll be moving there in just a second. You can do these push-ups with us. So we're starting with our heels in our Pilates stance. Inhaling as those arms come all the way up. As so we exhale, dropping the chin down towards the chest. From here, we're gonna take four steps of the arms forward. One, two, three, four. Now you can either stay up in your plank or you can come to your knees. I'll leave that choice to you. But when you do your push-ups, elbows go back. So here we go, we're doing five. So down and up and down and up. We have three and up. Belly in, don't let it drop down towards the ground. One more, bend and lift. Hold it here, walk the arms back in. Two, three, four. Hold it here, roll it all the way back up. Lifting those shoulders up by the ears, rolling them back down. Another set, inhale, those arms come up. Exhale, dropping the chin down towards the chest. From here, walking those hands forward. One, two, three, four. Holding it here in your plank, maybe coming to your knees. We got five push-ups, here we go. Down and up, down. Keep those elbows in and down and up, down. And up, holding it here, scoop the belly, squeeze those glutes, walk the hands in. Four, one, two, three, four. Rolling it all the way up. Lifting those shoulders up by the ears, rolling them back and down. One more set, here we go. Inhale, reaching those arms up. Exhale, dropping the chin down towards the chest. Go ahead, walking those hands forward. Four, one, two, three, four. Finding that plank, here we go. One, and up, two, and up, three, and up, four, and up, last one, five, and up, walking the hands in, one, two, three, four, rolling it all the way up, one vertebra at a time, lifting those arms up by the ears, and rolling them back and down, good job. All right, we're gonna take it to the mat. We're gonna get ready for some Pilates mat exercises. So I'm just gonna go ahead and move my setup a tiny little bit. You guys can dra grab a drink of water if you would like. Just wanna make sure you can see my mat and you can see me. Those are two very important things. When you're trying to teach an online class. Let me get this clutter out of the way. All righty, are you guys ready? So we're gonna go ahead and start standing at the top of your mat. Here, go ahead, crisscross those ankles. Hands are gonna come up here to a genie position. We're gonna take an inhale as we exhale. We're gonna sit it down onto the mat without using our hands. Good. From here, bring the feet together, squeeze those inner thighs. We're just gonna hold on to the back of the legs for a second, just stretching out the back. So inhale, lengthening up through the crown of the head. Now as you exhale, tuck your chin down in towards your chest as you scoop that belly. Good, inhale, sit up nice and tall. And exhale, scoop the belly, taking it backwards. Inhale, sit up nice and tall. 
and exhale dropping that chin down towards the chest scooping that belly inhale sitting up nice and tall now on the exhale taking it back bringing those legs up to your position for your 100 whether you want it in tabletop or stretched all the way out reach those fingertips pull the shoulders away from your ears engage the inner thighs and start pumping those arms so we're inhaling and exhale inhale and exhale inhale and exhale inhale and exhale inhale and exhale make sure you're relaxing that neck inhale and exhale inhale and exhale inhale squeeze those butt cheeks exhale two more sets inhale and exhale one more breath inhale and exhale hold it nice and tight and bend those knees in dropping the head down just rock it side to side here and let's get ready for some roll-ups so we're stretching those legs out straight in front of you arms are going to come back over the head deep inhale here as we exhale the chin's going to come into the chest rolling it up from here stretching forward over those toes crown of the head reaching forward inhale i like to sit up tall and then i exhale as i roll it back squeezing the inner thighs inhale exhale chin comes into the chest rolling it up relax those shoulders right here stretching it forward inhale sit up nice and tall exhale take it back so scoop that belly inhale arms come all the way back exhale touching that chin down in towards the chest sitting up nice and tall stretching it forward inhale exhale roll it back scooping that belly good job let's do two more inhale and exhale scooping that belly sitting up nice and tall stretching it forward inhale exhale rolling it back we got one more here inhale and exhale rolling it up stretching it forward and inhale exhale rolling it back good arms come down by the side from here we're going to get ready for your rollover so those toes let's scooch down a little bit are going to come up to a 90 squeezing those inner thighs nice and tight together now if you need to you can use your hands to help you pick those hips up so i'm going to take an inhale as i exhale i'm pressing into the back of my arms as i'm bringing those legs back overhead parallel to the ground so this is where you would use your hands to help you from here flexing the feet open those legs shoulder width taking an inhale as i exhale rolling down through that spine from here closing my legs inhale exhale roll it back inhale open those legs shoulder width exhale rolling it down through the spine keeping a long neck go ahead close the legs inhale exhale roll it back legs are parallel to the ground open those legs rolling it down pausing right there with those legs in 90 taking an inhale as we exhale rocking it back the opposite way closing the legs inhale exhale rolling it down legs open shoulder width inhale exhale roll it back go ahead closing those legs inhale exhale rolling it down we have one more here inhale exhale roll it back legs are parallel with the ground go ahead close those legs inhale exhale roll it all the way down go ahead extending that left leg down towards the mat let's leave that right leg up from here go ahead just bend that right leg in giving that leg a nice stretch here sending that right leg up we're going to take it into some single leg circles arms are down by the side we're going to cross it over the body exhale bring it up inhale and exhale inhale and exhale inhale and exhale try not to wiggle those hips too much one more pressing that left leg into the mat opposite way open the leg swoop it back up two three four we got six five and six good hugging that knee in towards the chest taking a nice stretch here then go ahead lowering that leg down to the mat take the left leg now bending it in taking a stretch really pressing that right leg into the mat from here we're going to send that leg all the way up towards the ceiling arms are going to come down by your side inhale as you cross it over the body exhale bring it up inhale and exhale 
Inhale and exhale, pressing into the back of the arms. Activate those triceps. Crossing up, crossing up, crossing up. One more. Now take it the opposite way. Open that leg. Inhale, exhale up. Two, three, four, five. Last one. Six. And hugging that knee in towards your chest. Go ahead, stretch that leg out in front of you. Arms are going to come back up over your head. Feet are in your Pilates stance. Another roll up here. Inhale as we stretch those arms. Exhale, chin comes into that chest, rolling it up. Sitting up nice and tall here. Go ahead, stretch it forward. Just flex those feet, giving it a nice little stretch here. Good. From here, we're going to scooch all the way to the top of your mat. Go ahead, hold on to those ankles. We're going to tuck the chin into your chest, getting ready for your rolling like a ball. Here we go. So we're going to take it back and up. Two. And up. Three. And up. Four. And up. Five. And up. Six, and up, seven, and up, one more, eight, and up. From here, extending those legs all the way out for your double rake, leg rocker. So the legs are open shoulder width. Now if this exercise is too much for you, just continue your regular rolling like a ball. Here we go, back, and up, back, and up, back. And up, keeping that chin in. Back. And up. Back. And up. Back. And up. One more. Back. And up, holding it here. Go ahead, closing those legs, bringing the legs down, bottom of the feet together. Sit up nice and tall and just stretch it forward. Beautiful. All right, from here, we're gonna sit all the way up nice and tall, open that heart. Just feeling a stretch here through the upper body. Good. All right, from here, we're gonna take it to your side. So we're gonna lay on the right side. Those legs are gonna be stretched out in front of you slightly forward with the kneecaps facing forward. Um, lifting up on your elbow here. So you can lay all the way down if it's hard for you to stay in this position, but I want you to try to keep this upper body lifted so you can find that length. We're gonna take the top arm out to the side, just stretching for that wall, finding length again in that arm. From here, we're gonna lift the leg up and down. Up and down, we're squeezing the butt. Up and down. Up and down. Good, up and down, up and down, up and down, up and down. Good, now from here I want you to take this top leg, bend it in so that toe is touching the knee. Kneecap is facing forward. From here we're gonna do some clam shells. So that knee is gonna open up and lower down. Hips are staying forward, the knee opens and closes. Open and close. Open and close, squeezing the glute. Open and close. Open and close. Open and close. Open and close. Two more. Open and close. Open and close. Good, now take this top leg, step it over. Yeah, so that bottom, the instep of the foot is down on the mat. From here, we're going to lift that lower leg up and down. Up and down. Up and down. Up and down. Good. Up and down. Up and down. Up and down. Up and down. Up. And down. Up 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 and down
and down. Beautiful. From here, take this top leg, send it back out. Kneecaps are going to face forward and we're going to do a little bit of rond de jambe. So you might want to bring that top hand down in front of you. From here, we're going to swoop that top leg forward. From here, open it up to the side as far as you can, keeping those hip bones forward and then sending the leg towards the back of the room, trying to keep that belly button pulled into the spine. Go ahead, bring that leg back in, send the leg forward, inhale, bring it up, circle it to the back and bring it right back through. Now reverse that, take the leg backwards. Hip bones forward right here. Circle that leg, squeeze the glutes, stretching the leg forward. Go ahead, send it back one more time. Back, lifting it up, sending it forward, bringing it in. Good, holding it right here. Eight little circles forward. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight circles back, squeezing the butt. Two, three, four, five, six, seven, Eight, good, go ahead, sit it up, bend those legs in. Let's do a mermaid stretch here. Right arm's gonna come up, stretch up and over to the side. Enjoying that stretch there. Good, bringing that arm all the way up and we're gonna take it down to our left side now. So those legs are stretched over towards the left side of the room. Just propping yourself up on your elbow here, scooping that belly button in nice and tight. Go ahead, taking that arm that's on top and floating it up. From here, we're lifting that leg up. We lower it down. We lift and lower, keeping the belly pulled into the spine and lower. Lift and lower. Lift and lower. Lift and lower. Lift and lower. Lift, lower. Lift, lower. Lift. Lower, good. Now bending that leg in, finding that passe position. So the knee is facing forward. From here, clamp shell. So we don't want to move the hip bones, just to open the knee. And lower. If you hung out for that far, you'll probably be feeling this already in those glutes. And lower. Lift. And lower. Squeeze the butt. Lift. And lower. Lift. And lower. Lift. And lower. Lift, squeezing the glutes, lower. Lift, and lower. Lift, and lower, keep it going. Lift, and lower, last one. Lift, taking that leg, crossing it over so the foot is down. Stay nice and lifted into this elbow. You might have to readjust it like me. From here, we're lifting the bottom leg up and down. Lift, and lower. Lift, and lower. Lift and lower, lift and lower, lift and lower. Keep that belly pulled in tight and lower, lift and lower, lift and lower. Last one, lift and lower. Good. Go ahead, bringing that hand forward, turning those kneecaps. We're getting ready to go with those rond de jambes, so we're going to kick that leg forward. From here, opening the leg out, squeezing the glute. Go ahead, trying to take the leg back while not popping the rib cage. Scoop that belly, swoop the leg through, sending the leg forward. Opening that leg up towards the ceiling, squeezing those glutes, sending that leg back, scooping that belly in, feel those abs work. Bringing the leg back to home base. Now take it back the opposite way. Leg will kick back. We're gonna open that leg up, sending it forward, bringing it back in. Take it back again, lifting it up, and taking it forward, bringing it right back, kneecaps forward. We got our little circles. Here we go, eight each way. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, and back. Two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. Good, sitting it all the way up. Go ahead, hold on to those ankles, stretch that arm all the way up. Stretching over to the side. Good. Bringing that arm up, we're gonna take it down to our backs, getting ready for some teasers. So those legs are gonna stretch straight in front of you. I'm gonna bring my arms all the way back behind my head. Some song there I got going on. So we're gonna take an inhale as you exhale, chin's gonna come into the chest as we roll it up, lifting those toes up nice and tall. So if you need to do a variation here, go for it. 
We're gonna inhale, as we exhale, we're gonna lower back down. Imagine someone's pulling those toes, pulling those fingers in the opposite direction. Inhale, taking those arms all the way back up over your head. Again, exhale, tucking the chin in towards the chest, scoop the belly, lifting it up. Squeeze those inner thighs, try to find that length in your spine. Inhale, exhale, rolling it down, stretching those toes out. Arms are back over the head. Inhale, exhale, chin comes into the chest, rolling it up, lifting it up, stretching those toes, stretching the arms, holding it here, inhale. Exhale, rolling it down. Arms come back up overhead, we got two more. Inhale, exhale, chin comes in towards my chest, scooping the belly, relax the shoulders here. Now try to lift those toes higher. Inhale, exhale, lowering it down. Good, really trying to use control with these teasers. One more. Inhale, exhale, scooping the belly, lifting it all the way up, relax those shoulders, holding it here. Go ahead, lowering it all the way back down, one vertebrae at a time. Taking those arms all the way back up over your head. Good, arms are gonna come down by your side. Go ahead, bend those feet into a nice froggy position here. Just let those hips open up. Squeezing those glutes. Taking the arms up overhead, stretching them back. Taking a deep inhale here. And an exhale. Another inhale. And an exhale. Good, go ahead. Oops. I'm really winning today. From here, closing those legs. All right. What we want to do from here is we're lifting those legs up into a tabletop position and extending them all the way up towards the ceiling. Flexing the feet, inhaling. As we exhaling, opening out into a straddle, lifting those arms out to the side, coming right here to your inner thighs. Just holding that stretch. Taking a nice inhale here. And exhale. Another breath here, deep inhale. And exhale. Last breath, inhale. And exhale. Good, bringing those hands underneath the legs. Go ahead, closing those legs back up. And we're gonna get ready for a little bit of jackknife. So arms are gonna come down by your side. Taking an inhale. As we exhale, we're gonna roll it back. Toes are coming parallel to the ground. Inhale, pressing those heels up towards the ceiling. Scoop the belly, squeeze the inner thighs. From here, toes come back parallel to the ground. Inhale, exhale, roll it down. Heels reaching up, good, let's repeat that. Inhale, exhale, legs come parallel to the ground. Inhale, exhale, stretch those heels up towards the ceiling, try to scoop the belly. Inhale, exhale, those toes come back parallel to the ground. Inhale, exhale, rolling it down. We have one more. Inhale, exhale, roll it back. Inhale, exhale, send those toes up, pressing through the back of those arms, holding it there. Inhale, exhale, send those toes back parallel to the ground. And roll it down. This time taking it all the way right back up to a teaser. Holding it here, scooping the belly, pressing down through the back of your arms. Good, just go ahead, drop those toes down. From here, sitting up nice and tall, stretching up through the crown of your head. And then as you exhale, stretch it forward, just opening up those hips. Good. From here, sitting it all the way up, we're gonna take those legs out into a straddle. So they can come right in front of you, taking those arms out to the side. From here, inhale as we hinge it forward. Now, I don't want you to touch the ground. I want those kneecaps up. And just hold it here for eight, seven, six, five, four, three, two, one. From here, dropping it all the way down to the ground. But try to keep those kneecaps up. Just holding the stretch here. Taking a deep inhale. And exhale. Good, hold it again, inhale. And exhale. One more breath, inhale. And exhale, taking an inhale, stretching those fingertips for me, lifting those arms all the way up. 
from here, stretching over to the left, taking an inhale as we exhale, stretching over towards that right leg, finding that length through the side of the body, trying to keep both hip bones down. Inhale, bringing it up, turning to the diagonal, just like those stretches we started with in bar. Reaching over towards that foot, you can pull it down, dropping your forehead to that leg. Inhale, reaching that arm all the way up. Go ahead, stretching to the right now. Inhale, exhale, stretching it over to the left. Enjoying that stretch here. Feeling that stretch all the way through the side of your body. Deep inhale here. Exhale, bringing that arm up. Go ahead, turn towards your leg, taking an inhale here. As we exhale, we're stretching it forward. Go ahead, grabbing, bringing that forehead to the leg if you can. Holding that stretch, taking a deep inhale. And exhale. Inhale, reaching it all the way back up. From here, bring these hands right down in front of your legs. Just taking an inhale and the exhale. Slide those hands out towards your heels. Almost pushing those legs out towards the side. Just stretch it forward here, holding. Trying to keep a nice long neck. Hold it here. Inhale, and exhale. Go ahead, bring those arms all the way up. Just interlace those fingers. Take an inhale, reach it all the way up. Exhale, floating those arms down. Right from here, we're going to take this right leg. We're going to flip it backwards. Do you feel a stretch here? From here, just go ahead, lean it back. Kind of leaning in a diagonal. I just want to feel a stretch through the front of this hip. Just holding it here. Good. And no skipping out at these stretches. You guys should all know by now, stretching is very important to me. And it should be to you too. It's just as important for our body to feel good. Good. Sitting it all the way up. On flipping that leg. Just take the other leg, flip it back now. We're going to lean it backwards, stretching through the front of that hip. And just take it back as far as you can to whatever feels good. Holding that stretch. Good. Nice. Bringing it all the way up. We're going to go ahead and take it to all fours here. So just come to your knees, bring those hands right underneath your shoulders. We're just going to take an inhale as we exhale, press into those hands as you round that back up. Inhale, exhale, drop the belly down towards the ground. And switch it back through that rotation, becoming your angry cat. Then dropping the belly down towards the ground. And again, pressing into those hands, scooping the belly. Dropping the belly down towards the ground. One more time like that, pressing it up. Dropping that belly down. And then just go ahead and rock it back towards those heels. Walking the hands in by your knees, taking an inhale as we exhale, rolling it back. Heels come down, feet into those Pilates stance. We're rolling it up one vertebrae at a time. Inhaling, lifting those shoulders up by your ears. Exhale, roll them down. Again, inhale, lifting them up. Exhale, rolling them down. Let's take one more here. Inhale. And exhale. And wherever you are, a nice big curtsy. Inhale. And exhale. Stretching it back up. Beautiful work, you guys. And you guys are all done. Thank you so much for joining me. Um, as I said in my class this morning, I should be back on schedule for the rest of my week, so I should have no more goofy, weird class pop-up times for you. My classes should be live like normal. Um, if you'd like to draw, join me for a Zoom Pilates mat class, I'm teaching that again on Thursday at 7 a.m. I would like to add one more um, Zoom class this week. Um, what I've been doing is a 30-minute mat class. So if you're interested in that, please let me know and let me know what time is good for you. And once I get another little group together, um, I will schedule that. Anyways, I hope you guys have a wonderful class. Hi, Atar. Thank you for joining me. I missed you.
Anyways, did I do both sides on each exercise guitar? You're still there. Your kids haven't dragged you off yet. Sometimes I forget. Anyways, um, I love you all. Have a wonderful evening, and I will be back again tomorrow. What is tomorrow? Wednesday at 10.30 a.m. for Gentle Payo. So if your legs are sore tomorrow, Gentle Payo will be where it's at. It's going to be nice and slow and stretchy. All right, bye-bye.